Hey guys, it's Brick Picture Productions here, and today this is going to be kind of a special video on the UCS Millennium Falcon. Now I know a lot of you have seen the rumors and hints LEGO has been giving about this Falcon on their social media pages, and I just kind of wanted to put this video together to kind of sum up some of those rumors and maybe give an accurate uh, description on what this thing will actually cost so be sure to watch the whole video it's going to explain a lot if you're a UCS Millennium Falcon fan like myself this is going to be the video for you first we'll sum up all the rumors we, from Lego we have gotten so far the first one is the instruction booklet we've gotten on their Instagram page and Twitter and Facebook a picture that said that shows two instruction booklets and the caption says that a new instruction booklet is coming that is 2.56 times bigger than the LEGO Carousel instructions, which is the biggest instruction booklet LEGO has ever made. So this this is going to be about 600 pages, somewhere around there. So it's, it's very, very big. Next, we got an actual video of a, like an animation of them assembling a Lego set and we got a scene that looked to be what they were assembling kind of like a, a hatch or the side of the UCS Millennium Falcon that was two weeks ago now and the most recent one last this week we got uh, bricks that said uh, the Taj Mahal is the biggest Lego set ever made but something bigger is coming with about 1600 more pieces which means this is going to be very close to 7,000 pieces, which is, like, insane for a Lego set. That is all the official rumors we've gotten so far, so let's get to the actual new information. Now, on to some new information. Now, this information is unofficial, of course. A few days ago on Instagram and Reddit, there was a leaked photo of a Chinese ad with the new... UCS Millennium Falcon on it. Now, unfortunately, I cannot show this photo because the video will be taken down. Lego has taken down many posts of this video, so that confirms it is real. So this um this photo showed a remake of the Falcon. The Falcon was very modded, but it had the same shape and dimensions as the old one. It was just heavily modded. It had a lot of tiles on it, new cockpit piece, etc., and it, it didn't show an interior, it just had the outside photo, but I imagine it will have an interior with 7,000 pieces. So on, on this ad, it also had a price tag of 8,500 China in Chinese currency. And when you translate that, it will translate into 1,200 US dollars. Now this got a lot of people scared, myself included, but then when I thought about it, I realized that this happened before this year, actually, with the Obi-Wan's booster ring. We got that as a leaked image in China first, and when you translated the currency, it said it was going to be $200. Obviously, that did not happen. It's only $100 US dollars. So, obviously, the prices are overinflated there, and this will not be $1,200. Nobody would buy it at that price. Now, for... There was a trusty Instagrammer that saw this UCS Millennium Falcon for sale at their local Walmart, actually. And they said the price was $750. And I actually do believe this because it's it's def I was more going towards $800, but $750 sounds better than $800. And as, as in, in marketing terms, that would definitely make more sense and make more sales because $800 versus $700... It seems better. So, it's $750. I'm going to strongly say that's what it's going to cost. It's going to be in the reach of a lot more people than $1,200, but it's still going to be out of the reach of, you know, just say the regular kid. So, with that, guys, I hope this gave you some more information. We're going to actually get official photos from Lego this, uh, this Thursday. So, it's going to be exciting to see what happens. I'll keep you guys posted on this so be sure to subscribe and there's going to be a short update video coming up on saturday so with that guys peace out